Hey, welcome back everybody. I'm Jimmy the Saint. This is Seven Days to Die. Um, been playing this game for a while. Thank you for tuning in again to this series. Uh, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. Tell your friends about it. Thanks for watching. Uh, my lead. Okay, that's that's the two things I need to work on. I need to get bullets. Um, and I need to smelt iron too. Hmm. Hang on, sorry, I'm thinking, I don't know if I've got any clay to make another mold. I don't think I do. Uh-uh. Okay, so I need to make a mold to make bullet tips. Sorry, getting ahead of myself. I need I need to make a mold uh, for bullet tips. If I'm going to make bullets, ammunition, um, you don't, you, you don't need them for the shotgun shells, but you do need them for pistol rounds and rifle rounds and that sort of thing. Um... And since I don't have a shotgun, shotgun shells don't really do me a whole lot of good. Uh, so I would love to be able to... I, if I had a shotgun, that's what I'd be making, the shotgun shells. Um, but I don't, so... <laughs> I can't. It's not doing me any good. Uh, so let's run in here real quick and let's do... This. Let's throw this iron I brought in the forge and get it melting down while I go and scavenge a little bit of clay to get a new mold made for let me just make sure I don't have any clay over here I got three but that's not enough to make a uh, mold okay iron let's throw my iron ore in there and the coal burns a long time so you throw your coal in there and you get a long burn out of that so throw that in there and Let's see, I got my lead over here, my brass over here. I need to make a brass mold, and I need to make a bullet tip mold. Um, think for just a second here. Can I do that? Okay, bullet tip mold. Okay, it'll let me do that. Okay, so... Let's do this really quick. Let's break down one so I can show it to you really quick. Break down... Damn it. There we go. Break down an item. So I'm going to take a bullet, put it over here, and I get its component materials out of it. What I need is the bullet tip. Alright, so with the bullet tip, I can use that bullet tip to make a bullet tip mold. Watch. Let's see. Bullet tip mold. But you have to have a bullet tip to make the mold to make bullet tip. So it's kind of like a you got to have it to make it sort of thing. It's a catch-22, as they say. So, but I need five lumps of clay. I've got three, so I only need to find one uh, thing of clay somewhere in the world. So, uh, I don't have a shovel, but I do have this. So, while that iron is uh, melting down, smelting, let's go see if we can find some clay really quick and get a bullet tip mold going so we can get some bullet tips. I may just need to make a second forge somewhere. Uh... See, usually I almost all, I can see clay from here. Okay, you almost I'm gonna say you almost always find it around water. It's the easiest place I've always found it at. But I could probably dig down underneath this fertile dirt right here and find it too. But it should be right here on the riverbank. Clay. It's a wow. That's floating. Uh, it should be this reddish material right here. This reddish brown dirt. Be able to dig one of these up, and that ought to be plenty. Come on. Shovel would be so much faster. There we go. One clay. That's all I needed. Uh, take that clay, throw it in my center, get me a lump, lumps of clay, and go ahead and make that bullet tip mold, which is like that. With the bullet tip in the center, and now I get a bullet tip mold. And basically you take the bullet tip mold, put it in your forge, Take your forged lead, your lead ingots, throw them in there as, as the melting item, and it melts into bullet tips, and you get a ton of them really quick, so it doesn't take much. Um, alternatively, for shotgun shells, you just take your lead uh, ingots and break them down directly in your crafting menu right here, and they break down directly into uh, buckshot, and uh, the buckshot you use with gunpowder and paper to make shotgun shells. So. But like I said, I, I would normally be making shotgun shells and be focused on that, but I don't have a shotgun. I don't have enough parts to make a shotgun, so... Um, 
actually, I know where we might be able to find some parts because I left. I was full on inventory and didn't want to drop any of my stuff. And there was a. Um, let's leave that close to my lead. There was a. Um, a gun safe. I'm trying to think where it was at now. Let's throw those over there. What was a. Mm, sorry, I'm thinking out loud here, talking to myself. There was a gun safe that I found. I was going to loot it, but my inventory was full and I didn't want to drop any of the stuff I had. So I didn't get around to looting it. It's. I'm going to make sure this has got enough fuel to keep going for a while. There we go. Um, I think I remember where it was at. We'll go over there. I think it had a shotgun part in it. I know it had a pistol part, a couple of pistol parts in it, but I think it had a shotgun part or two in there. I just did not have the inventory space. And I was like, oh, well, I'll come back. It was right over here. It might be this house right here. I know I knocked down the front door on it, so we'll know pretty quick. Yeah, okay, so this should be it. Um, and I looted everything else in here except for that. I just got my inventory got full. Where's my torch? Ah, damn it, I should have dropped that bucket of water. Yeah, this is the place. Because I knocked a hole underneath here. There we go. Yeah, this guy had bullets too, as I recall. Yeah, 10 millimeter bullets. Uh, hunting rifle barrel. Okay, so we got a shotgun receiver out of there, a short shotgun stock, and a short shotgun barrel. So we might can make a, let's see, pistol part, pistol part. Oh, that's hunting rifle part. That's pistol parts. Okay. So we might can make a, um, I think that was everything. Yeah, so that was everything in this house. I don't have any candles to mark it either. Yeah. All right, let's so let's take these back to the uh, back to the base and see if we've got enough stuff to make a shotgun. Because we can make a shotgun. I'm not gonna spend a lot of time making bullet tips and things like that. I can just make. Shit, I went the wrong way. <laughs> uh, I can just make shotgun shells. Even if it's a short shotgun, it's still a shotgun. Um, and with a shotgun, I can fight dogs like nobody's business. I'll make a trip out to the hub for that. Alright, here we are. Back at home. Let's see what we got. Get upstairs here. See if we got... Forge is nearly done. So we're let's see if we make a shotgun here. Put these hunting rifle parts in, hunting rifle barrel, pistol parts. Okay. Shotgun receiver, shotgun receiver, shotgun receiver. So I got a purple shotgun receiver, so I should probably break down one of those. Submachine gun, shotgun, short stock. Huh? Damn. I do not have enough stuff. Pistol barrel, pistol barrel, pistol barrel. Damn it. Pistol parts, pistol parts. I do not have enough stuff to make anything. Well, damn. Uh, it's disappointing. Okay. Uh, wait. Wait, 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 wait. What am I talking about? I did not see the shotgun short barrel there. Sorry. Hang on. Hold on a tick. Ah, I do. I do. I can make a shotgun. I can make a shotgun. Okay. Uh, let's see. Dur, 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 the pump. The receiver. Uh, the stock. And the barrel. Hey, I got a sawed off shotgun. Ha ha ha. Sweet. Alright, it's not the best in the world, but you know what? 
it's a freaking shotgun for crying out loud. Hopefully, it's not it's not that good. Hopefully, it'll do enough damage. I did not want to waste all my purple parts on it. I don't know because that seems like it's pretty. Uh, actually, I wonder if I should. Hang on just a minute. Quality 406, quality 539. Let's try it like that and see what happens. It didn't really change that much. It actually does, wait, it does less entity damage that way? I swear it said it did 11 with that. So yeah, the how much something is repaired plays a big role in how much damage it does. Wow. Yeah, 11. But now I wonder if I repaired it with a weapon repair kit, would it do better with that? Huh. Boy, that's really got me thinking now. Hang on. Let me see if I can make a weapon repair. I don't have the stuff up here. I bet it's all... I got oil and cloth. What else is needed for it? Some sort of metal fragments, isn't it? Okay, metal strips, cloth, and oil. So let's try that. I mean, make five of them real quick. And, uh, I can throw the rest of this stuff in here. Alright, so we got some weapon repair kits. So let's do that real quick. Let's break this back down. Like that. Let's use the best parts we've got. Craft it. Okay, so it did 11 earlier. Now it's doing 9. Let's try and repair it. And see if it does better damage now. Now it does 14. Ah ha ha. I had a suspicion that might happen. Okay, so... I repaired it a little bit more, and now it does 15 entity damage. So that's good. Okay, so that's use the best parts you can and then repair it. That seems to be the way to do it. All right, cool. Cool. I see we're learning stuff all the time. So I'm not going to really bother making that much ammo other than um, shotgun shells now. Uh, there's shotgun shells, so, you know... I got a shotgun, so let's make some shotgun shells. Uh, that's the last of our iron there. Let's go ahead and... Oops, wrong button. Let's go ahead and get the last of this iron out. That'll get me one more ingot out of there. Nope. Come on. There we go. Alright. There's our iron. We've got a shotgun now. It's 12... It's 1 o'clock. Okay, so let's plan a... Uh, let's get together what we'll need and plan a trip out to the hub city. Let's see, where are we at here? We need to go... Not that far north. Okay, so that's the hub city there. We're not actually that far. We really just need to go due west to get to it and with a shotgun and a pistol might be able to do all right actually let's make some um let's make some pistol rounds and shotgun shells uh i've got a bunch of iron can i make any iron armor let's try that really quick we get together and we might make a, a run of this iron leg armor okay so i need Forged iron and leather for that. There's my leather. Is it? I already took it down into the cave. Okay, and... Iron leg armor, and I can make iron chest armor as well. And I'll need leather for that too. Okay, so we needed to go get our leather and uh, get to work on armor. Yeah, let's do it. Get some armor going, some shotgun shells, some pistol rounds, and, uh, 
gonna make a run for the hub, I guess. Oh, shit. That almost glitched me. Oh, man, I meant to plant some more of these... You know, I've still got a blueberry I never picked, so let's pick that up and plant it really quick and... Oh, that's right, you have to break those down into seeds. Alright. Blueberries like coffee, you don't get much out of it, the blueberries. You don't get much to plant per harvest, so... the hell? Okay, yeah, there we go. So, we've got our coffee planted from earlier and our blueberry from planted from earlier. Uh, I don't still have any goldenrod on me now. Okay. Let's organize our stuff and get ready to run out to the hub. It's not that far, so gotta be careful. I do not want a broken leg, which will pretty much keep me from going out to the hub city. <laughs> Have, it's been a while since we've been out there, so it'll be fun to go back out and loot some. Uh, the loot has all respawned. I think it should have all respawned pretty much from the last time I was there. I think it, if not, it'll probably will be by uh, by tomorrow. I say tomorrow in game, tomorrow the next day in the game. Um, we need to make some ammo and some iron armor. Let's get on that real quick. Um. Let's see, here's our chest, that's food chest, let's throw the painkillers in there. Hey guys, thanks so much for tuning in and watching the video. Uh, please, if you haven't already, hit the subscribe button. If you're not a subscriber, hit the thumbs up button if you enjoy the videos. I post a new video every day, so guys, please be sure and tune in again next time. Thanks so much for watching, we'll see you guys again.